vlogs today. Hopefully this isn't too echoey. I'm filming in a different room today. As you can see behind me, I have some clothes and some shoes. I'm gonna be doing a haul video. I decided that maybe I might do one of these like once a month. So let me know in the comments or just give this video a thumbs up right now if you want to see that. And just basically I'll do like a collective haul of all the clothes and shoes I've got this month. Does that make sense? I think that'd be quite a cool idea, right? Um, but let me know what you think of that. So I'm sorry if it's echoing in here, but this is the only room I can really film this in where I've got enough space to like hang everything up so I can show it to you properly. Because when I film like in my normal space, it's like, this is my top, do you like it? So I thought this would be better. So hopefully the echoing is not too bad and it isn't annoying. So let's just get stuck into what's going on behind me. Starting off is the top I'm wearing. This is a new, it's like a cropped, obviously cropped Adidas top. I love it. This I got probably like the beginning of last month. So quite a while ago it feels, but it is new. Um, I got it off ASOS. I will leave everything I can find. I will leave in the description bar below. Um, but I love it. I love that it's long sleeves, but it's baggy. It's like t-shirt material. A nice length. I don't really like, yeah. It's a nice length, super comfy, but look really good with high-waisted jeans or leggings, high-waisted leggings. I tend to wear crop stuff with high-waisted stuff. I really need to develop for these, right? <laughs> Keep falling down. Um, so yeah, that is this one. So the first item, which you can see, I haven't actually worn yet. This is a dress from Pretty Little Thing. Isn't it so nice? So it's like this silky material. It's got like this drapey bit here. I got this in a size 10. It fits absolutely fine. It's kind of like a shirt dress because you've obviously got the collar. Um, but super cute in this like champagne-y color. <laughs> champagne. So let's quickly put this on so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so this is the dress on. As you can see, it's got like the shirt collar. I wouldn't wear a bra with it, but obviously I'm trying on loads of stuff, so to keep changing my bra and stuff would be quite difficult. But I have tried it on without a bra and it's totally fine. Because it's quite hangy, it's fine. You can always use some tip tape if you need to. Um, long sleeves, I think I'll maybe roll these up. Maybe just like a little bit. I like the detailing on the bottom here, which I don't know if you're able to see right now, but I'll give you a close up here. So you can see, but I really like this detailing on the bottom of the dress and the way it kind of gathers in at the waist. I think it's pretty flattering. And um, the shape of it, I think is really nice. And I really like the plunging neckline. It's such a pretty color, right? I really like this color. Yeah, I think it looks super shiki deeky, right? Yeah. Okay, so next up, I have this beautiful dress right here. How nice is this, right? Um, this is from a shop an online store called, I think it's Manier, Manier de Voix, Manier de Voix, I don't know how to say it, um, and it's like this, it's got the lace up detail on the side, it's super thick bodycon dress, um, I did actually wear this out for, it was Pete's birthday a couple of weekends ago, and I wore it out for that, and everyone was like, literally everyone was like, oh my god, I love your dress, um, I think because not many people know about this online store, I think it's starting to get big like now, they don't have like a huge selection, but the stuff they do have is really bomb. I brought, I bought two, two like dressy items, and I also bought two bikinis from them. Um, they've got like really nice stuff. So let's pop this one on. Okay, so this is this dress on. So as you can see, it's like a tight bodycon dress. Um, but it's really nice and thick material. Um, totally got the wrong pants on it with this, so you probably totally see them. And also this one is definitely fine without a bra. When I went out, I wore it without a bra, it's totally fine because as I said, it is super, super thick. Um, I have seen some people wear this where they've undone this a bit more, so it's a bit more open. Not only my kind of thing, but you could totally do that if you wanted to. Okay, so next up I got this other dress. This is from Misguided. It's like one of those sort of nighty cami style dresses. Um, I like this one because I love the colour for a start. And I also like the way it's got like the lace bits on it. And it's quite low at the back. So let's put this one on so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so this is this dress on. I have just taken my bra off because I wanted just to show you that it obviously is a low back. And it's just like a really loose fitting cami dress. You've obviously got the lace here. The straps are adjustable, so you can make it a bit tighter if you need to. But I really like the way it's just like really loose fitting. I love this colour. What do you call this? Like rust kind of? Maybe? I don't know. It's a super nice colour and so easy to just throw on 
with, I like it with like chunky boots, which I wore when I was in Italy. I'll show you the picture here. Um, that's kind of my favourite Rota Stani's kind of dresses. But yeah. Okay, next up I got this skirt. This is also from that website I told you about earlier, the Manier de Bois. Um, it's like a midi skirt, but it's got like this cut out detail at the side. I love this skirt, it's so nice. And I did also wear this on holiday and I paired it with this top from Pretty Little Thing, which looked so good together. So I'm gonna put this on, both of these on now, so you can see the outfit together. Okay, so this is the top and the skirt on. So as I said, this top is from Pretty Little Thing and probably one of my favorite purchases that I got. Um, I just love it. I think it's so nice. The colour of it is amazing. Again, no bra, totally fine because it's just quite supportive. And I just love the way it looks like it kind of just got this lace bit on. I think it's really cool. And then the skirt is, as I said, it's obviously got this bit at the side. These are actually elastic. So you kind of don't need to worry about them breaking because like, when you sit down, they just stretch because obviously they're elastic. So it's like this faux suede material and it's obviously like this nude kind of camely colour, I guess. Um, with this. I wouldn't probably like it if it didn't have this because I'm not really a midi skirt kind of person. Um, but with this, I think it looks like classy but sexy at the same time. I got the skirt in a size 10 and the top in a size 10 also. I don't know why I keep saying my tiptoes. I just feel like I need some invisible heels. Um, I'll insert a clip here because I did wear this outfit in Italy for dinner and I did record a little clip of it so I will insert that here as well. So next up I got this really pretty simple black dress, um, it's like a silk material though which I don't really be able to see on that camera but it's a v-neck, pretty low v-neck and it's just like a t-shirt dress, pretty baggy. This is, is a size 12 so this is a size bigger than I would usually get, I can't remember why I bought it bigger, probably just because I like t-shirt dresses to be quite loose. Um, but let's pop this on so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so this is the black t-shirt dress on. As I said, it's obviously sort of low. It's not super low, but it is low. Um, I haven't got my bra back on, but you totally could wear a bra. I have worn this once where I put on like, you know, the bras with the harnesses underneath. That look quite cool because they kind of came up here. So you could totally do that. So it's just like t-shirt material and obviously it just hangs completely straight down. I like to wear it, well you can wear this with heels and like dress it up. Or you can also wear it with like chunky boots, which is what I like to do. Um, so yeah, either way, just up or down, it's just super easy just to throw on. Okay, so next up, yeah, we're all done with the bottoms, it's now just tops and jackets. This top right here, which is the misguided, this is one of the Kylie by Buff misguided range. I actually got this, this is her one in grey, but misguided themselves, not in the Kylie Barber range, also do it in black. I got both because I loved it, so I'm just going to pop this on so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so this is the top on. It is super nice, it's like almost like a bra bit here, like you don't need to wear a bra with it. And then this bit is obviously, you can see, just like see-through lace. But I really like the lace. I'm not really like a lace person, but I think this lace is really nice. I really like the finish of it, the way it's like kind of raw edge. As soon as we're doing this top, I might as well just quickly pop the black one on so you can see how this one looks. Okay, so this is the black one on. I forgot to tell you, it does have a zip here that you just do up at the side. You just do it up here. Um, so obviously you can see they're like exactly the same, right? Like everything about them is exactly the same, obviously apart from the colour. I did get both of them in a size 10, but this one is smaller, which is quite weird. Um, it's totally fine, if anything this one maybe fits better because it's a bit tighter around here. Um, the other one's a bit looser, it's totally fine, they both are, like work, but this one is just a bit tighter, which is weird. I did wear this one out the other night and I wore it with some black high-waisted jeans and just some like thin, you know, like minimal heels, and it looks really nice. So that is how I would kind of style this. Although you could wear it with just normal colour jeans, it would look quite cool too. Okay, so next up I have this nude crop top. This is from Pretty Little Thing, and uh, it's nude and it's cropped, and it kind of does up kind of at the side. It's almost like a wrap detail. Um, so let me just put this on for you. Okay, so this is the nude crop top. This one is shorter than I would normally wear. Um, but if I had like proper high waist, <laughs> like up here, that looks attractive, then obviously this is how I wear it. Um, it goes really nice also with that skirt, the midi skirt I put on earlier. 
it would look really nice with that as well. Um, this bit is, you can tighten it and loosen it. I like the way it just kind of hangs. Really like the shape of it. I think it's just a really nice, I, I think I really like it so much because I like the colour. It's like a really nice nude colour. You could probably wear a bra with it, but it's quite low here. So I don't really know what bra you'd wear. You have to wear like quite a low one, maybe. Yeah. Um, the material is like kind of thin, but still supportive. Don't know how that works, but it is. Okay, so next up, another one from Pretty Little Thing, which if you follow me on Instagram, you definitely would have seen this, um, because I, this was like one of my favourite purchases from them. Like, so cute. Look how nice this is. It's like completely open at the back. So nice for holiday. I wore it loads, because it's like really nice to shove over the bikini. I wore it loads in my denim shorts. I'll insert a picture here, which I've got my Instagram, I've been wearing it. But let me just put it on now so you can see. Okay, so this is it on. Obviously, I don't have a bra on right now, but you totally can wear a bra. As I said, I wore it on holiday over a bikini, which is really nice. Obviously, the back is completely, like, backless. So if you do wear anything underneath, you can see it at the back. Um, but you don't need to because it's the way it's obviously crocheted here. It kind of covers everything. But super cute. I love this colour. It does also come, I think, in white or, like, cream white colour which I really want as well. I think it's white, yeah. Um, I'll leave it down below, but to me, this is just so cute. This is like, perfect. <laughs> so this one isn't a size 10, it is a size 12. I don't remember if it was because they didn't have a 10 or because I just wanted it bigger. Probably because I wanted it bigger, because it's kind of that kind of thing. And it's actually, it kind of hangs. I don't know what the 10 would be like, but to me, this fits perfect with how I want it to fit. So, Okay, I'm just going to put this top back on just to show you the last thing, which is a jacket. Um, this is also the Carly by Val from Misguided range, and it's the rose gold satin like lace-up bomber. So let's just quickly put this on. It is a long line bomber, which is what I really like about it. I'd much prefer long line bombers. Um, so yeah, you can see obviously it even covers my shorts, like it is pretty long. Um, it's obviously got the lace-ups on the sleeves, we could get a close-up over there. They're quite loose, like, you know? So I actually thought I got this in size 12, and someone asked me on my Instagram when I put the pictures up here, um, what size I got, and I thought I got a 12, because I wanted to get a size bigger so it was, like, baggy and long. But when I actually just checked it a minute ago, it's actually a 14, so I actually got two sizes bigger, but that's probably why these are a bit loose. But it's actually totally fine, and I love, like, how it's, like, oversized. Um, I like that kind of look, and the colour is amazing. It's pretty thin, it's not really going to keep you warm, but it's perfect for like, right now because we're kind of like, summer still kind of going into autumn, but not quite there yet. So it's perfect for that. So that is the last item of clothing, and now I'm going to show you some shoes I got. I've got tons of new shoes recently, so I'm going to show you them now. Okay, so first pair of shoes are some new trainers. Don't need to show you two pairs. These are the Nike All White Harachis, or Har Harachas, whatever you say it. These ones, so they're completely white all the way around. They've obviously got the Nike on the back. They're almost like a stock at the lace up. I don't even want to do that. It doesn't really do much, to be honest. And um, they're just completely white. Yeah, they're so comfortable. Like, so comfortable. They're actually a little bit hard to get on because they are just a sock. So you just kind of have to like, pull your foot into it. But once they're on, they are like so, so comfortable. Um, so really like these, I'll link them down below for you. Next up, another pair of trainers, which I haven't actually worn yet, hence why I haven't laced them up. These were from Ego Official, um, I'll leave them down below, but I love these. They look like Adidas, right? Like they totally look like Adidas. And um, they're in this amazing faux suede and gray color. I love this color. Really just like love these so much. And a really good cheap alternative if you don't want to actually invest in some Adidas because obviously they can be a little bit more expensive. And I just oh, I just love the colour of these so much. They did have a ton of colours. I'll link them down below so you can just check them out for yourself. Um, but yeah, super comfy and I just love trainers. So yeah. Okay, so next up I got these boots. These are from Ego Official. I don't know if it's Ego or it's Ego Official um, as well. I love these. I actually wore these out for Pete's birthday with that lace up dress I showed you. I wore it with these, it looked so bomb. Like it really looked really good together. And I just love them, I think they're super cool. They're almost like a, like a knit. It's almost like a thin knitted boot almost. Obviously it's got the cut out here, it's got a wooden heel and it's peep toe. These are so comfortable. 
Like, I was actually really surprised at how comfortable these were. Like, so comfortable. I wore them out for dinner and all night. Like, we didn't get home till quite late. And my feet, I didn't even think about my feet, you know. They're that comfortable that you don't even think, oh, I've got heels on. Like, so comfortable. I was really surprised. So, really nice and really affordable. Next up, I got these strappy. This is going to be really hard to show you off. Um, these strappy, like... Kind of blush coloured heels they're like crossed up the ankle these are from public desire they kind of all crossed up the ankle and they've got like a chunky heel i put a picture of these on my instagram which you can see here and you guys loved these shoes like everyone was like oh my god i love these shoes they are so nice and again super comfortable they might even be in a sale now and they definitely have loads of colors of these they had like a nude my friend got the nude which is really nice and um, they've got like a beige i think they've got like a cream I don't, they must have black I think as well, but they've got loads of colours and super comfy and so nice. Next up I got these sort of more, I don't know, these like sandals from Office. I got two pairs of shoes in Office in the sale and um, they've also got a wooden heel. I've got kind of study bits on them, I don't really know how to explain them, that kind of goes around your ankle. You'll obviously be able to see better here once I've got them on, like what they look like. I think they're really cool and they're like a bit more edgy rather than like too pretty of a sandal, which I really like to like edge up an outfit. They look really nice with that black shift dress I showed you, just gives it a bit of an edge and also gives you some height without you looking like you're tottering down heels. So I really like these and as I said they were in the sale so I'll try and find them and leave them down below because if they're still in the sale then you need to get them because they were literally like I think £15. The other pair that I got in the sale from Office are these, kind of similar because like they've got a chunky heel um, and they're also like strappy. I wore these so much on holiday, like buckles, like all down the side that like do up all the way around. You'll probably be able to see better once I've obviously got them on. Um, but they are honestly the most comfiest shoe ever. So I will try and find them a link below because if they have still got them, like you need to get them. They're real suede and they were like maybe 20 quid. I can't remember, but I'll find them. I'll try and find them if they've still got them and I'll link them down below. So nice. And then lastly, I've got two pairs of boots. I've got one pair of over the knee boots, which <laughs> look like this. <laughs> um, I love these. I love over knee boots, especially going into autumn. The reason why I like these ones so much though is because they have a chunky heel and they're peep toe. I totally don't need to be holding both of these. They're obviously faux suede and they've got a zip up the side and they fit perfectly. Like they fit so, so well. And like they just fit your leg like tight but not too tight and it's just I think they're really flattering and I absolutely love these and I'm gonna wear them loads again it's super comfortable I'm always a bit funny with buying shoes from like online stores because you never know if they're gonna be comfortable or not but so far so good like probably design and ego and places like that I haven't had any issues with them being comfortable so I really like these and then the second pair of boots I got are these ones which loads of you have been asking me about oh my goodness um, I did wear them in Italy, I love these, I love a chunky kind of biker boot, um, they've got like the two buckles here and obviously they're completely cut out at the side, so they're obviously like super super chunky, like these definitely aren't for everyone, but I liked them because the shoes that I love are the, the Balenciaga, have got like a shoe that's like a chunky cut out boot and I want it so bad, this is like, it's not, they're nowhere near like the same at all, but it's a similar style, like with the cut out chunky boot. I love these with like dang cut offs, or I love them with like that cami dress, or any kind of dress just to like edge it up a bit. I think it looks so bomb. So I'm really pleased with these. I didn't even tell you where these are from. These are from eBay, and they were £7. Bargain! I will try and find the seller and leave them down below. Like, that is an insane amount of money. Like obviously they're not good quality, but they're totally fine. They look so good on. So the last thing I got is a new bag, which you guys definitely would have seen if you follow me on Instagram because I've worn it literally non-stop. And it is this uh, Celeron blogger bag. It looks like this. I'll just give you a close-up. Isn't she pretty? Oh my god, she's so pretty, right? I love her. I love the colour of her. She's just so pretty. So it's got a long strap and obviously it's tiny, like this is it on my hand. So it is super, super small. Um, you've got the huge tassel at the side, which I absolutely love. It's got gold hardware inside. Oh my God, it'll be a mess in here because I've just literally not stopped using it. So I don't know if you can see that very well, but it's got like card slots on both sides, the, the front and the back. So it's kind of got everything you need and it does fit my phone in it. I have the iPhone 6. 
and it totally fits in here perfectly. It's got another little pocket at the back, so you can put stuff in there. This bag, they do in like so many colours. So this is the colour, they call this Camel Nude, which is my fave, like I totally love it. Any other bag I have is black, so I really wanted like a nude bag. But they do have it in black, white, pink, blue, red, like so many colours, like so many. I want like every single one, but obviously they're not cheap, so yeah. Um, I will link it down below for you if you want to check it out for yourselves. But I can't tell you how much wear I've got out of this already, so a really good purchase. Okay, so that is everything that I've got this last month in August. Um, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and as I said, if you want me to do this every month, then let me know, and I totally will. And that's everything for this video, so I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys! So I haven't obviously decided what I'm going to wear for this. <laughs> you just totally got in the shot. <laughs> Okay, we don't need to for this one. But I wanted to get it a size bigger because I do like them really big and long. But oh. That's it, friend.